What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's me, Kev the Gamer, no Chavage Gaming channel of course. Now today's video, I'm going to be showing you the easiest and such a really good method of basically using your PS5 wireless controller on the PC to play your favorite PS2 games using the PCS X2 emulation. So this guy's really simple. All we've got to do is literally pair the Bluetooth controller and the PCS X2 will do all the work for us. Now what it will do is the benefit of using a PS5 controller is it will map the buttons exactly the same as the original PS2 so you don't need to worry about your buttons and your controls being in different places now this would only happen if you're using an Xbox controller or another game controller but if you're using a PS5 controller or PS4 controller whichever one you want to use the buttons are automatically mapped so they're exactly like the original PS2 controller was so when you're playing your emulation games on your PC your PS5 controller will work like a dream and the bonus is it's completely wireless so let's go straight into the video guys alright guys so the first thing that we need to do on the PS5 controller is tap the middle PS button and the top left share button now holding these two down exactly the same time we'll put the PS5 controller into Bluetooth discovery mode so you can see it flashing blue here that means it's in discovery mode so you can now go on your PC and search for the PS5 alright guys so I've turned the Bluetooth on on my PS5 controller so I'm gonna go to Bluetooth and we're gonna add a Bluetooth device so activating the Bluetooth mode on your PS5 controller go into your Bluetooth devices hit add a device and we're gonna go for the top one Bluetooth devices make sure and discover there we go so you can see the PS5 controller DualSense wireless controller I'm gonna press that hit connect and it should connect Bluetooth automatically to my PS5's controller. Right, once that's done, it says connected. That's all good. So you can see here, DualSense wireless controller. Now, all we're going to do is go on to the PSX2 emulation program again. PSX2. And we're going to go to system and we're going to chat the controllers. So there you can see it's controller DualShock 1. What we're going to do here is we're going to change it to PS5 controller DualShock 4 enhanced mode. We're going to hit that. Now here you can see it's on DualShock 2 and we're going to do automatic mapping and we're going to select the PS5 controller. Now it should have automatically mapped it to the PS5's controller so once that's done, just hit close. Guys, you can see me sat here playing with a PS5 wireless as well. It's not even plugged in for USB. So I'm playing it wireless on the PC Burnout 3 takedown. The visuals have been upscaled to 4K. And I just want to say the controller works absolutely fine. The buttons are exactly as they were on the PS2's original controller, as is a PS5. Bearing in mind, if you were to use an Xbox controller, then the controls may be slightly different because these buttons are slightly different. But using a PS5 controller is actually very retrofit and very simple and easy to use. You can see me here.